Hi, this is Drew Georgiatis, Chairperson of Public Works and Planning, recording on December 11, 2024. Um, we, um, I would like to, I, at uh, 9.07. Thanks, Jay. Um, I, um, we would, um, I'd like to call to meeting, um, Call this meeting to order. Do I have a second? I'll second that. Chris Carroll seconds it. Um, uh, Chris, could you, um, as the secretary, could you please call the attendance? Okay. Uh, Jay? Jay Walk, here. Andy? Here. Andy Graceffa, here. Drew? Drew Georgiatis, here. Uh, Jonathan? Jonathan Delgado, here. Nancy? Nan here. Nancy Donnie, here. Chris? Here. Chris Carroll, here. Peter? Here. Peter Britton here. Colin. Colin. Colburn. Colburn here. Okay. Um, so um, we have several items on the agenda tonight. Um, the first item on the agenda is the uh, reappointment of the Harbor um, Harbor Management Commission. Um, there are. Um, three people, uh, Jeffrey Warren, um, Dave Henry, George Harris, um, for permanent positions. Would you guys like to um, have a discussion? I'll make a motion to accept those, all three. Ma okay. Peter, Peter Britton makes a motion to accept all three. Second is Nancy Dunning. Uh Thank you. Is there any discussion? Any discussion? Nancy? Yeah. Okay. And those are the three permanent. Permanent, three permanent. Any discussion? All in favor? All in favor? Aye. 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 Um, uh, opposed? None. Um, abstain? None. It's unanimous. Um, moving to item two, Harbor Management Commission appointment um, uh, as alternates, Chris Smith. Michael Baisley and Belinda uh, Shepard. Um, may uh, Chris? Okay, Peter Britton, um, make a motion to accept the uh, alternate appointment. Second. Andy Graceffa second it. Um, is there any discussion? No discussion. Um, all in favor? Aye. Aye. Um, any opposed? None. Any abstentions? None. Uh, vote was unanimous. Um, going on to item four, um, it is the, um, uh, do you think we should bundle these or do the two with the police separately? What do you think, Peter? Um, let's, we're gonna combine um, item three um, no, item four and item five, the EMS resolution that was presented by Deputy Chief. Uh, Actually, oh, wait, sorry. Two. Number four is the fireman. These are the agenda items. That's presentation order. Oh, okay. Do you want to agenda item? Isn't that the, isn't that the agenda order? This is the fire. Sorry, I'm not being a very good chairperson. <laughs> um, the item four was EMS resolution um, as presented by the fire department, right? Let me get back here. No. So go to go to your email. Sorry, I'm bothering you around. No, that's good. I'm not sure you can zoom in or not. Um, I can. I can go to this. So items. Can you read that? Um, item seven, agenda order. Item seven and eight are the CGS and CT grants. Item six is the. Okay, so we're going to go um, agenda item six, the emergency management resolution as presented by Deputy Chief Dunn. Um, anybody want to make a motion on this item? Jay Walk makes the motion. Anyone seconding it? Okay. Um, is there a discussion of this um, uh, item? No discussion. Um, all, all in favor? Aye. Aye. Um, opposed? None. Abstention? None. Uh, vote was unanimous. 
So agenda items seven and eight, PSG and CIT grants as presented by Deputy Chief Waya. Um, would somebody like to make a motion? Andrew Gasefa to accept. Any second? Um, Colin, um, is there any discussion? Um, I'd like to bring it to a vote. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Um, any opposed? No. Any abstentions? No. Um, vote was unanimous. We're moving on to agenda items 9 and 10, the um, ADA grants as presented by Julie DeMarco. Um, do I have a, a someone motion to accept? Colin, second by Nancy Dunny. Um, is there any discussion? No? I have a question. Yes, Chris Carroll has a question. Um, and I don't know when to address this. That's there okay. is a park in Newtown there. My daughter and my grandson there mm -hmm. all the time. They have this type of equipment. It doesn't work because it's broken. And that's why I asked you the question how are you going to make This is all being paid by a grant? But so. It work. Well, what? Yeah. yeah. Okay, it does work in a girl manner. Okay. Yeah. I'm just happy that the whole front of that parking, that old playground, is going to be now a park. Fantastic. Because you used to just sort of look through the gate. Because um, you're right. Okay. So, um, great. Um, I'm going to bring it to a vote. All in favor? Aye. Um, opposed? None. Abstentions? None. Um, vote was unanimous. Um, moving on to items 11 and 12, vaccinations and workforce grants as presented by Sans Claria and Santina Yaronko. Um, Chris Carroll makes a motion. Andy Grisseth seconds it. Uh, Andy, um, any discussion? I think the the fifty thousand that was spent on the media um, is part of the grant, like it's required by the state. Yeah. It's not a lot of money for media. No. Yeah. Probably already. Particularly for trying to reach. But they're working the 50,000 with the, each town has 50,000. So I think it might ramp up, especially since you can't really segment. And you. Oh, no, I'm not. I mean, I work for, an, for good housekeeping and we couldn't segment that. You know, we had 52 markets and that was it. So you have to sort of pull the money and then spread it wide so um okay any additional discussion anybody um I, i'd like to bring it to a vote all in favor i um opposed none um abstentions none uh, vote was unanimous um okay item 13 at 396 quincy street acquisition presented by mark barnhart through Georgiatis to um, uh, you make a motion. motion. Thank okay. you. Anybody second it? Uh, Jonathan Delgado. Um, is there any discussion? No? Program. It's a great program. And I would like to be, um, it's fantastic he got the contiguous pieces because um, that's super hard. And all those houses are on a slab. So. None of them are compliant. So. Okay. Yeah. I'll, I'll fill you in. Yeah. Okay. Um, anyway, um, I'm going to bring this to a vote. Anybody in? Everybody in favor? All aye. Uh, opposed? None. Abstentions? None. Vote was unanimous. Um, item 14. Uh, we are not voting on the RTU uh, Riverfield RT replacement. Um, 15, the HVAC, as presented to David Becker and project team, that is for next week. Um, so we'll table 14, we'll table 15, um, and um, 16, the um, established the Elderly and Disabled Tax Relief Committee. Um, 
that will be done at a future date um, uh, prior to January. Um, so um, is there any additional questions before I adjourn? Motion to adjourn. Andrew Kassef, a motion to adjourn. Second, that. Second by Peter Britton. Thank you guys very much for coming tonight, and we'll see you next week at 8 p.m. So um, meeting is adjourned at 9.17 on Monday, uh, December 11th. Thank you.